the final EG I will explain is the EG during a non-convulsive status epilepticus. So, what can we see on this EG? There is the name of the child. This is an, again a longitudinal montage. So, we have the left side. Of the brain and the right side of the brain this is the middle so this height amplitude is uh, increased from the artifact of this electrode uh, and uh, we can uh, do not uh, pay attention uh, of this so what we can see we can see the great amplitude difference between left and right side of the brain. That is the first uh, page. You can see 12, 42, 45, my mistake. Uh, so, front to temporal, there is a high amplitude spike and wave complexes these are main focally with the middle generalization in left hemisphere in all leads there's again parietal occipital and again frontal so frontal lead we have focal epileptoform discharges of one, two, three, four, five spike in weight discharges with high amplitude. So this is in F7. How can I see? There's the sharp wave and slow wave after her. F7, F7. In the next lead, we see the reverse. So, this discharge in of F7. So, the next pages. Next pages. Very interesting. Again. Left side of the brain right side of the brain you can see again focal epileptiform discharges multifocal you can see very high amplitude uh, sharp waves and sharp wave complexes so what is this this is you can see the left side and the right side of the brain. There's a one, two, three, four, five. Five hertz sharp wave, sharp and slow wave, spike and wave discharges. There's a one second when sharp waves and again sharp and wave complexes this cannot be you can see that is in the whole left hemisphere in the right hemisphere the edge is complete normal in the middle in the midline you can see again the same sharp wave and slow wave as a did left side of the brain this cannot be the heart uh, the ECG artifact because we have one two three four one two three four five of, mm, between four and five spike and wave discharge in one second 
uh, if there is an ECG artifact, uh, it uh, will be uh, one or maybe possibly um, maximum two waves in second. Uh, there is no way to have uh, five beats in second. Uh, that means uh, that the child has uh, tachycardia. So no, this is uh, complete uh, excluded. So the next page, another burst in the left side again, left side and the brain, left right left side in the brain burst of spike and weight discharges after which multi spikes frontally and uh, generalized in the left hemisphere so what can we see some interesting in this page do you see that we have change the amplitude and the type of the waves in the right side. So the non-convulsive, left non-convulsive status get go contralateral in the right hemisphere for one second. This is very uh, bad because uh, if the stats um, makes generalized um, can leads to uh, brain problems and the last page you can see again there is the first page uh, that's recording uh, begin uh, is uh, during uh, about more than 20 minutes, about half an hour. Uh, the recordings is all the same in the all time. Again, left side and the right side of the brain. The picture is the same. We have spike and wave discharges in the left side of the brain and focal discharges in the frontal region in the left side of the brain so this was very interesting what is the problem the problem is that we see only in one uh, time she have a uh, frontal discharges uh, one time there's a periodic occipital uh, the other time there's a temporal occipital one seizure starts temporal completely left temporal uh, there's where uh, her um, cortical dysplasia is uh, but in the other um, it starts uh, the seizure from frontal region uh, typical frontal seizure with uh, starting with frontal region um, that is the um, the other side of the brain uh, there, there is a complete uh, no connection with the cortical dysplasia so the doctors is uh, not sure um, the 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 ages uh, from the years that we make it uh, and get uh, interictal and nictal, um, that means uh, um, between the seizures and during the seizures, are starting on the different places, starting uh, frontal, temporal, uh, occipital, uh, and um, their suggestion, there is some for something of uh, cooperation between the metabolic disease and uh, the cortical dysplasia so, so we don't have one problem we have two and uh, they cannot localize um, one focal changes they are multifocal so this uh, unfortunately 
um, there is uh, completely impossible to make a surgery and um, remove the cortical dysplasia because uh, this is not going on. Um, dual problems because the changing in her brain is uh, multifocal so she have uh, cortical dysplasia in the left uh, occipital lobe she have uh, multiply um, synchron and left and right frontal um, gliosis uh, which uh, which uh, maybe have uh, some problems um, and uh, the most worse is uh, that uh, their quality um, quantity is uh, 